just on stream and uh, a lot of other players who have kind of yeah. still dabble with the character. And this is top 24 now, by the way. Yeah, this is top 24. This We made it outside of the pool. Three, two, Kofi, by the way, qualifying for Loser's Top 24. He's now playing against Bonkai. Super unfortunate to see the Tri-State take each other out like that. Fire. Fire, fire. Make a quick for me right there. Jeez, 8 man off to pretty much the best start you could be. Like literally taking a stock with no damage. Couldn't wish oh. for anything more. Mage almost getting something started there, but just not able to complete. Take a minute, this a big body of Rob. That's what you have to do when like fighting against this character. Yeah, especially as a character who's super combo oriented like Falco. You really thrive in these matchups. Maybe not necessarily in the neutral. That's one of Falco's weakest departments, but once you get your hands on them, if you can make it really count. Oh! oh. Wow. Well, I like the attempt. <laughs> Looking for that wave land, you know, but just a little bit off the mark and sliding past the edge. Mage. Still showing that the combos are on point. Like, that's not the trouble here. Um, so, just a couple good openings and we can see Rob's stock start to melt. Like that. Yes, right there. Up tilt. Reverse up tilt into bear. He can keep to a full Falco. Needs to make it up. And gaining for... Attacking up percent is not a problem. problem. So, definitely could see a comeback on the rise. Oh, so great to so just aerial into the up. Got a uh, battle of the southeast here, by the way. Mage hailing from South Carolina, a bit man from Florida, of course. And both strong power rank players in their regions. Well, we're seeing a little bit of a swing here into the favor of Mage. Yeah. Just can't help but think if those first two stocks didn't disappear by uh, yeah, in, uh, maybe a Falco win. Oh, smart of Mage to reflect the gyro to gain control of it. Yeah, Falco oh. with a lot of really cool niche tools in this matchup against Rob. Wow. Clanking out the scoop hitbox only of the up smash and just not being in range for the top. That was insane. Mage is in his own right now. He's casting, bro. Wow, short hop double laser. I haven't seen that in like six years. Yeah. Looking like brawl here. But of course. <laughs> oh, Mage though coming back with a vengeance. Okay. One clean confirm could get him like what? 60 damage given the right circumstances. Oh, oh. but enough smash out of shield. Oh, get off of me, he said. Yeah. What a rock greatest points right there. His up smash but, is only 10 frames to start, Jesus. Yeah. But we saw Mage make that comeback. So if I was if I'm Mage right now, I'm pretty confident. Because I essentially threw two stocks away. Yep. So, yeah, the fact that that was still competitive, you know. Yeah. Got so, and we're gonna play on my counter pick. Sorry? And and they're gonna play on Mage's counter pick? I'll, yep. pretty I'll be pretty pumped back when this set. Yeah, or at the very least, take it to a game three and then start off on like some equal footing. You know, you each have yeah. your exchanges of a strong win or just winning at all, and then just kind of reset. It's a fresh best of one at that point. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Okay, here we go. Game number two, it's going to be Pokemon Stadium 2 again. Wow, 8 bit man opening up with the big stuff. I don't even know if Smash would be safe on a hit at that point. But it's so strong that it Oh, nice up tilt. Not being able to be show grab from the range. Mage almost getting the loop started, but Ape Man not going to get hit by that last drag down of neutral that would have been essential. He's lasering him from point blank range. They're out of shield for Falco, but not able to get the fastball drag down. I don't even know if that's possible off rising up or in there. Oh, you start right there. <gasps> getting it right there. Oh my. Go 
Good lord. Hate to see that kind of thing happen. Yeah. Just the double. Do it again. And this is where Fossil kind of struggles. The auto shield game is not some of the best. Also, for Falco. Yeah, not at all. You pretty much only have Nair. And that's not the best move for auto shield. It just doesn't have that much of a forward reaching hitbox. And it doesn't cover it all above him. Mage just throwing out hitboxes. Nice payback for Mage. And likewise, the 8 bit man keeping himself out of that back air range and then counter edge guarding for the stock. Another two stock lead here for 8 bit man. And, you know, say what you want about the first two stocks of game one, but those were fair and square. Just yeah. outplayed. So Mage down to possibly his last breaths of the winner's bracket here. Back air out of shield, though, gonna put him back in it. Okay, we can see the crazy Falco stock where you just get, you know, six pieced into another six piece that ends in a kill. <laughs> Call it six <laughs> I mean, it's fitting, right? Yeah. And here we go. <laughs> Hold the soft air. Oh, and the landing there. Okay, this is that fabled Falco stock and the parry to keep it going. All right, mage. Ooh, off the top. All right. And only having 41% now. Pretty sure he made Falco in Smash 4 too, so um, I'm liking this, man. This looks like a, a seasoned, well-calculated Falco, not just like mashing into the quickest, easy combo you can. I mean, obviously not going to be PR'd in your region by uh, being free, but still, yeah. I'm impressed by Mage for sure. Definitely loving the bird. Go birds. Oh, 8-Bit yeah. Man! Crazy read there, just calling the bluff, going all the way out with the side B, taking the set. Jeez, that was like a, a brutal finish, man. Just yeah. shutting the comeback down in its tracks. And 8-Bit qualifying for top 8 right there. All right, this is still 2 out of 3, right? Uh, Yes, everything is 2 out of 3, I believe. Okay. Um, but could be wrong. Yeah, top eight only, best of five. Thank you, Devin, on uh, production. Um, also, big shout outs to the House of 3000, man. These guys put New York City on their backs um, just in general, you know, in the normal swing of things when we have live events. They're always running stuff down at Zeno in Chinatown. Um, great venue, great place to come. I mean, the Tri-State Smash scene, I'll, I'll vouch for them all day, bro. Coolest scene in the entire world. So definitely come check out a Zeno. Yeah, thanks, man. When, when it's safe. Big asterisk. Oh, true, true. <laughs> Otherwise, don't check out Zeno. Seems like on the other stream we had Sharp over with Salvi. Like an engine that we just saw earlier. So, 